What's going on? IT Kings back in the building. I mean, y'all should know what this is. Man. <laughs> I don't know what to say. I'm lost to words. This is, I've been waiting on this shoe. Like, I, if y'all don't know, this shoe did a little surprise drop, right? What day was that? That was, what day was that? That was yesterday, which is when this video will be out today. So yeah, yesterday, they surprise dropped these sneakers at six o'clock. Thank you so much, J23 app, because you're the reason why I was able to get these shoes. Because if they did not post this, I would have not got this shoe. I'm trying to get some of this tape off. I can open it up. Here we go. But yeah, so y'all should know what it is. I've been like, I've been waiting on this shoe all day. And for it to get here now, oh, it's amazing. See, that's why I also, see Nike, they, they make me mad too. Okay, so look. This box, y'all don't need to do it. I'm okay with y'all putting a little swoosh on the side of the cardboard box. But the Just Do It tape gives it all away. So, you know, those porch pirates are going to be heavy. But I'm not really worried. I'm not going to really worry about that, you know. But they're heavy. So that, I don't like how Nike did these boxes. But the package inside is amazing. Because I did rush shipping on these. So... Right here, you got your receipt. And then, oof, man, I haven't had a pair of Air Joint 6s since I did the UNCs. Oh, gosh. I haven't even seen them yet. We're going to go and do everything before we see them. So, we got the, it doesn't even say, yeah, it, does. it says Air Joint 6. Let me see. I'll go focus. Air Joint 6 Retro, black and infrared, size 11, retail for $200. I was going to wait, but I was like, shit, let me go and get these out so I can go get a review. But yeah, you got your little stamp uh -huh. on the inside right there. This box is so big. I'm sorry, you guys. But man, oh man. Ooh I did rush shipping on these. I I didn't, I, at first I was kind of mad that I did rush shipping. But then I was like, okay, I, that was a good idea. Because look. These out real quick. You got your trash bag paper, you know, nothing special. Boxes to it, so that's something I gotta fix real quick. Hold on, hold on, hold on. All right, all right, so I fixed the box. But I'm gonna be wearing these all. I'm gonna wear them. I gotta wear them now because nobody else has them. So I always like, well, I mean, a couple people, but it, it was not really many people who were able to. A decent number of people were able to get, but not a lot. But yeah, whoa, this shoe looks kind of small. Let me, let me check them out. Make sure they don't look that small. Oh yeah, they, yeah, they straight. Oh yeah, they straight. Yeah, they straight. All right. We got the Air Jordan 6 Black Infrared with that Nike Air on the back, man. I ain't never been this excited for a shoe. Let me go and get my thumbnail real quick. But yeah, Whew. super duper nice shoe right here. So, this shoe was epic. I mean, this is like an epic cop. I was just sitting on the couch, and then I felt my watch vibrate. It vibrated this time. I'm so happy. I missed I missed the, um, it didn't alert me when those Concords came out, and I was so mad. But, like, the thing is, it alerted me when those Off-Whites came out. I got on there the second they came out, and I still wasn't able to get them. I was, I was hot about that one, too. But, I was able to cop these, which is a really, really good, good cop. And, they smell really good. It smell like paint or something. It smelled real, real good. But, yeah. I knew they were going to drop these. I'm telling you guys. I don't know. I might have told y'all on this on here. I'm not sure. I might have posted a video telling y'all that they were going to come out. I already, because, if you know me, I knew the Blacksmith 3s came out. So, I knew that these were going to come out. Hold on one quick second. So, I knew that the Blacksmith 3s that came out, so I knew these were going to come out early as well. So, I went on the calendar. I was trying to remember. I had to go watch somebody else's video who posted a video like the day that they dropped it. And it was I knew it was a Thursday. That's all I remember. So, I had to go on the calendar, and it came out. They said three weeks. So, I was like, okay, bet. So, I thought last week they were going to come out. 
But I knew they weren't going to come out like at 9. I checked at 9, then I checked at 11. Because at 11 is like knowing when they just like restock or early drops. And then I checked again at, and then at 6. That's when they know, that's when I knew that it's another time it could come out. And it came out at 6. But I did not know. And then a week passed. So I'm not thinking nothing about it. I had a feeling that they might come out. So I kept checking sneakers out. Then I forgot all about it. And then I got a it buzz. And it was J23. They said Air Dream 6 just dropped. I jumped up off the couch. I'm trying to get on the sneakers app. It's freezing and everything. But I was able to get through. I was able to get through. Which is super duper nice. And here they are right here. Mm -mm -mm. Paid that rush shipping, which I thought was a bad idea because it was going to take the same time as today, but it ended up coming in today. I've had, it's like right now is 4.54, so I got the shoe in less than 24 hours of me ordering it. But yeah, so this, I knew how the other ones look because I know somebody who had a pair, and this is not that light pink. It's kind of red. It's pretty red. It's, a, it's more red. It's not because the, let me turn off the light real quick so y'all can see. The extra light. You can see that's not really pink. It's more red. But I don't have the 2014 pair because I wasn't really able to buy that many shoes back then. But yeah, so you got your black upper. You got your 3M, which is showing up on the camera underneath your holes. Each side. You got your icy bottom with your red jump man. You got your. I just I'm just gonna say red. Red. If you hear me say red, I mean infrared, but. Yes, yeah, so you got this all right here, and it's like a it's like a suede right here. It's not the best best suede, but for a sneaker like this, it's pretty. It's probably how they were back in the day. Um, for this shoe, it's actually it's like very minor glue stains. Yeah, not really many glue stains at all on this shoe. All right, let me let me um uh, put one of them down so. You got your jump mirror right here. And then on your hang tail, I don't know if you can see it. Just the light kind of throwing off the glare a little bit. Hold on. Is it going to focus? Hold on. Focus on my face. You see it? That Nike right there. So the Nike, it's a little bit lighter. Just a little bit lighter than this, but not much. So let me go and unlace these a little bit. So y'all can see the insole. But yeah, man, oh man. All right. Oh gosh, this thing is tight. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I probably won't leave the lace lock at the top. I might. Eh, I might. I don't know though. I'm just gonna take this off. So you, you know your little lace lock. You just stick that right there, and then. I'm not trying to make this video super duper long. Looks like it's gonna be about a 10 minute video. Oh, but I'm gonna put the on feed in here too. This I'm, I've I've been I've been surveying in a way over the past like all my videos I noticed that I do on feeds on get more views and stuff like that. So I think from now on I'm gonna start doing my on feeds again because I kind of got lazy after. I'm trying to think what shoe it was one shoe I did not do on feed on. But yeah, so you just got your standard you know plastic thing and then in the inside you got your Nike Air super nice sneaker yeah I'm gonna, I'm gonna get these these are gonna look dope on feet I already know I've been waiting on this sneaker for so so long to come out and it finally came out again thank you Jordan Brand thank you and I'm happy you dropped it early so I can get this review out to you guys early so yeah this video is gonna be you know probably about 13 minutes probably but you know these are nice i ain't gonna lie these are this is such a such a nice shoe i can't wait to wear them i'm probably gonna wear them i'm gonna probably wear them tomorrow or something but nobody else got their pair go and wear my pair so no so everybody already know they already can see it and then yeah but yeah here they are right here so let's get into the on feet. All right, you guys. So here on feet, I probably won't ever wear these pants with it because that big old swoosh. But I just want to show them with the pant. But yeah, here, right here. 
Honestly, if I were you, I either go true to size or half size down. Because this is my true to size 11, and they kind of are a little big. Like, they not how I like. I like my shoes to be a little snug. These aren't really that snug, snug, but they still going to be good. Because my foot is, like, in between sizes right now. But I'm so happy I did not get 11 and a half in these. Because that stuff would be flopping out of my foot. But, yeah, so I'm about to put on some different pants with these real quick and show y'all that. So, yeah.